Welcome Hello. to a, another Games Monkey cast. We're going to be playing Don't Starve Together again, me and Cadet, hosting a new world t together. Say hello, bro. Hello. I don't know whether to call you Cadet or Sean. Sean. I think I'll go with Sean, it seems more natural. Okay. Don't <laughs> <laughs> uh, sound so overly uh, enthused about it. I still haven't found your server. Uh, it's up now. It's oh yeah, running. there we go. in the secret, super secret password. Right, as soon as you appear, generally your first thing, pick up everything you can, but the main thing you're aiming for is finding some flint to make an axe. Uh, and have you worked out if there's any good characters, which are the better characters or which are the ones to avoid? Uh, I like the beardy guy. I've started playing with, or oh, I've had one other game with the teacher woman because she can do sp uh, make books and stuff. And which one but are you at the moment? I'm the teacher woman. Oh, the librarian. Yeah. I'll go beardy then. I've never been beardy. Beardy is he's nothing special, but there's nothing wrong with him and he grows a beard. No, There's nothing wrong with that. Cadets played this game a little bit, not loads, but certainly more than I have. So he's going to be talking me through it. Hang on one second, I need to turn my game sounds down or something. Yeah, I've got mine turned down really low on my just my Windows mixer. Um, yeah, I've uh, only been playing the game for about a week, so I'm by no means an expert. If we last the winter, I'll be happy. Uh, can't examine skeletons. So for those that haven't seen the game before, the aim of the game is in the title Don't Starve and the uh, it's very Tim Burton-esque I think is the word. He's uh, Oh I found some flint! You said I've got a fine flint. I found some. Good yeah. stuff. Find flint, find some twigs and make yourself an axe. I found lots of flint. Yeah. Don't bother so, with flowers at the beginning. Okay, so how do I build an axe? Uh, you just go into the little icon at the top, the tools icon. And she got twigs. I think it's twigs and flint. Yep, yeah, I have built an axe. Go chop tree. So one more. Basically, once, once you've chopped down a tree and you've got some grass, I think it's two logs and three grass, you can make a fire. Which means you can survive the first night on your own, and you don't need to be with me. But our aim at the moment, we're looking for beefalo. Beefalo? Oh, beefalo are normally on like uh, grassy land, aren't they? Yeah. I found grassy land. Oh, good. What we'd really like is a place that's next to a pig village and next to beefalo. Would be beefalo. Beefalo for the manure. I found so some gold as well. Shit. I think it's gold. It's a rock that looks like it's got goldy veins. Yeah. Did you go straight north from the spawn yeah. point? Oh, and I found found some. I don't think I want to go. On. Oh, big bird! On I'm running away, running away, yeah. running away! <laughs> big eyes. One well, one big eye. Not plural, really. Do they follow you for a long time? Uh, not not very long. You can outrun them. They follow you for a lot longer if you manage to steal their egg. Oh, that doesn't sound like that would be a, a clever idea. Uh, to be honest, you have you can hatch it, and I think when you hatch it, um, when it yeah, don't worry just yet. When you hatch it, what spawns out of the egg is your friend and helps you. I think. I'm not sure. Oh, you can just eat it. I can hear random growling from something as well. Like a... Probably frogs. Carrot? You made frogs? Frogs sound friendly. No, they're not. Is anything friendly? Uh, pigmen if you don't attack them. Beefler if you don't attack them. Bunnies. Um, it didn't seem like a very big patch of that grass stuff, and there were no bee flows. That's no good then. Try harder. Um, so pig village and bee flow, mainly bee flow. 
but when you're exploring, try and walk around the outside of the map. It's what a lot faster. Well, you know, there's water around the edge. Yeah. Walk around so as you can see the edge, and then when you come back to looking at your map later, we'll have a more mapped out view of where we can go. So, um, am I meant to be meeting up with you before night time? No, no, not if you've got grass. Well, go into your underneath tools, light, and make sure you can make a campfire. You don't have to make one yet. I can make a campfire. Good, and you picked up some food on your travels, I'm guessing. I have four berries, some seeds, and a carrot. Oh, Good, my axe then. broke, though. Yeah, well, you might have to make more as you go on. Um, we're just going to explore until one of us decides that they found the right place for us to set up, and the right place is in between Beefalo and the Pig Village. But probably Beefalo wins over Pig Village. But we also want to keep our eyes out for places with lots of gold and rocks. I have lots of trees and acorns. Definitely about to get dark, isn't it? Oh yeah, uh, start building a fire now. And get cooking up your food. Ah, I have fire! Can you cook everything? What do you mean? Oh, yeah, apparently you can cook berries. Yeah. Wouldn't have thought you could cook berries. Make a jam. I would need sugar. Yeah, I can you got me. I can make a syrup. You can't build a shovel yet, can you? From the tools. No, I am short of some twigs. Oh, but we'll let you do it if you can. Oh no, it's got a lock on it as well. Yeah, that's another thing that this teacher, woman, librarian can do straight from the off. The fire gets bigger the more fuel you add. Yeah, that you don't want to waste all your fuel because <laughs> it's almost morning as it is. So you said the mission was to store stuff up for winter? Yeah. When's winter? But that Oh, uh, I'm not entirely sure. I'd just be. Jesus, you don't seem like the best guide. Well, I'm. I'm, I'm, I'm uh, uh, I think it's about day 19 ish around that area, oh, but. Found loads more flint. Ah, flint. Oh, and a carrot. And why am I not bothering with flowers yet? Uh, flowers you only really need once your sanity starts going down. It's good to remember where there are lots of flowers. But you only really need it when your sanity goes down, and then you can make pick up eleven flowers and make one of those headbands to get your sanity back up. But um, that won't be for a couple of days yet, and it just fills up your inventory more, and they end up going off. Oh, turkey! Yeah, fucking turkeys are pain in the ass once you start getting a few berry bushes and then they all come to life and turkeys come in and eat all your fecking berries before you can get to them yourself. Can you not just chop a turkey's head off? You can if you can catch it. To catch the turkey you drop some berries on the ground and wait for it to come over to eat them and kick the crap out of it. Slap an axe in at the back of its neck. Pretty much. Oh, dry hay grass stuff. Oh, well, that's good. See, the thing about the beefalo land is you need the beefalo for the poo, but also around <laughs> beef. What? Yeah. Say so that. Repeat. You, I need, you need them for their poo. shit. Pretty much. You need <laughs> nice. them for the manure. Nice. To grow the farms and stuff, or to make the farms, and fertilize your berry bushes. But there's also lots of. Oh shit, inventory's full. There's also lots, lots of our shit. <laughs> lots of our shit as well. Not, lots of rabbits normally on bee floor land. Yeah, lots of rabbits, definitely lots of rabbits. And rabbits can be your main source of uh, food through the winter because your farms and berries and stuff don't grow. 
All there is is rabbits. Oh, and a spider's web. I'm gonna assume spider's webs are not. Oh, oh, oh! Good places to be. Yeah, you don't want to travel. Uh, you Ooh. don't want to walk on the spider's nope. webs. No, nope, I've got this little fucking hairy shit of a thing following me now. Oh, I found a touchstone. <laughs> there are literally out. millions of rabbits. That's good. Now, if you could just find bee flow in the same area. That'd be nice. Well, it's certainly a big patch of uh, this kind of land. There's nothing but grass and rabbits. <laughs> Actually, if you've got spare inventory slot, I take back what I said before. Start picking up flowers. Oh well, I'm not now. I'm nowhere near flowers. You mean? Oh yeah, that? yeah. But I have found a walking cane. Oh, walking cane's good. Why? Because uh, you put it in your... Oh, you equip it and you can walk much faster. And outrun a lot more things that are trying to kill you. To go in my... I oh, yeah. Oh, bloody hell. He's like, shit off a shovel all of a sudden. Yeah. Diddly dee. Diddly dee dee. Oh, seeds. I love them seeds. Thank you, Mr. Birdie. Uh, right. Loads of rabbits. Loads of grass. No. Nothing I would describe as beefalo looking. Try again. No poops. I've lost the edge of the land now as well, though. Yeah. Oh. Why did you change your mind about the flowers? Because um, I'm picking up berry bushes as I go along, and when I replant the berry bushes, we're going to need some beefalo poo to fertilise them or um, rotten flowers. So if we've both picked up flowers on our route and not used them, They'll hopefully be wrong. Can you pick up? I never thought to ask, but can you pick up your campfire when you leave? Not sure. You won't be able to pick it up, but you uh, might be able to smash it up with a hammer and get some resources back up. Probably not. I haven't got a hammer though. Effort. I'm guessing I yeah. need a hammer. Right. I think there's definitely no beef flow on this bit of land. What's some more seeds though? I do like my walking stick. Yeah, walking sprinting. stick's good. It's good for getting away from spiders, which I'm about to have issues with. I already got away from them just before I found my beeflow stick. I found a swamp. A beeflow stick? I meant walking stick. I know what you meant. I'm not finding lots of interesting stuff. Lots of twigs, trees... Yeah, well you may as well pick it all up. Uh, it's good to have a full stack of everything in your inventory if you can. Obviously not of everything, but full stack of twigs, full stack of hay. Because once you start building shit, Ooh, you go more, through More beefalo quick. type land. I've got I 35 grass. Oh, what's that? I found a stone path, and whenever I found a pig village, it's oh, always been at the end of the stone path. So I'm going to follow that. Uh, there's lots of birds flying in and out of the screen, but I'm guessing I can't get those. No, if I fall asleep at the edge of your campfire, you can get them, or if you build a bird trap, you can catch them. Well, you would hope so with a bird trap. That would be a oh, fairly yeah. disappointing thing to build on it, and you can't, actually. Okay. Still following the edge of the map. Do do do. I just keep feeling that if I'm on the edge of the map, I'm not going to see... The yeah, stuff. but the theory is, if you press M and look at your map, have you walked around like... I wouldn't say in a circle, but have you walked around and explored all the edge? I'm doing that. Like one area? Yes. Built like a finger, almost? Yes, well... I would say more like the Eye of Sauron it looks like at the moment. But then it wouldn't take much to just cut a path across the middle, would it? No. To explore, yes. Yeah, so that's what I, you know. What? Once you've walked around the edge of everywhere, it's it works out quicker. I'm guessing. Uh oh. Oh shit. I'm guessing yeah. later on in this game we can uh, dig up skeletons. Uh, once you got a sh dig up skeletons. You oh, can I keep finding skeletons. You can dig up graves. Normally when you find skeletons, they've got stuff around them, like planks and 
cans and stuff. Uh, oh, I did find my cane next to a skeleton, I think. Yeah, yeah. So basically, they've normally got goodies with them. You can smash them up with a hammer and get um, ashes. But, uh, yeah, it's easy enough to get ashes. Just burn shit. Food doesn't fill you up very quickly, does it? Oh, I don't know, I'm full. Um, I was eating stuff then to try and clear some space in my inventory. So if you had a shovel now, I'd be telling you to dig up the berry bushes instead of um, just foraging them, because then we can just plant them all at our place. When we get a place. When we get a place. <laughs> Baghead and I ran round one night for about an hour. It was about five, six days, and we didn't find any place that we'd liked enough to settle down. Come on, daytime. Toodles. And definitely nothing round this skeleton. Doodly. I'm on a uh, yeah another patch of grassy wasteland, but I still no poos or beef laws. I think I've just found a pig village. Oh what? Pig village. I thought you said a pig glitch. What? Oh. When I'm picking up the seeds, birds are leaving behind. Is that like bird shit? When I pick up bird droppings. <laughs> no, no. Well, it's seeds in it. So I suppose you could be yeah. Yeah. Because I'm eating them later on is the bit that's concerning me. Well, you know. Soon we'll be putting uh, seeds in fucking beef low shit. Oh, good. Waiting for it to grow. And then. Well, I suppose that's you know, kind of natural. Anyway, what's, yeah. mo what's less natural is eating bird shit directly, just putting it into your mouth. The whole manure growing cycle thing's been around for quite a few years and I think is quite well established. Oh, beef low! Well, a beefalo. He's done a couple of no, poos, though. Normally where there's more, oh, yeah, you'll find yeah. more. There's another, oh yeah, there's more beefalo. Oh, loads of beefaloes. Okay, and do you know your way back to the spawn point? You can see it on the map. Yes. Okay. So uh, pretty much uh, just north. Okay, well I'll start he heading north. Do you think I'll find it here? If I just head north? Uh. When you head north from the gate, the oh, I can see an egg on the map. Um, when you head north from the gate, you'll head across. W you'll find a path <laughs> heading north. You'll find a path you'll heading see north. A bush. No, you'll <laughs> that bush. turn left. I changed my direction. My plan for my direction. Yeah, find a path and just keep heading north on it. Right. And I think there might be a pig village next to me. Ah, oh, fucking. Well, I struck gold if there's a pig village right next to you. No, maybe not, maybe not. I thought, oh, that was a, oh. I thought there was a hut on the map, but it might just be a tree and a bit of grass. I've got some poos, I've got six poos. Uh, yeah, I suppose poos is alright for now, but we, we're not quite ready for the poo. We're not ready for the poo. Well, we need stone. We need stone to set up the actual fire. I could build a pickaxe, I think. Oh, there's. Well, you should be able to build a pickaxe. Yeah. Shitload of bee floors. Oh, hang on. What? Oh, I have found a pig village right next to the bee floors. Oh. oh, but the pigs are all chasing me, it would appear. Why are they chasing me? I don't know, but just run away. Don't let them catch me. I have found a pig village right next to the bee floors. Well, I'm assuming it's a pig village. Oh, hang on. It might be that fat king piggy thing. Ah. Ah. No, it's a load of pigs stood around like a patch of grass with torches. All oh, right, yeah, them the same protect. Don't go near them. I I bumped into them before. Oh, were they? Uh, they're protecting the grassland. I'm guessing if you um, had the muscle, you could go in and beat them up and take over their grassland. But you won't got the muscle. That would seem like an awful. Right, so you don't get anything special from the withered looking trees, you just get less wood. Yeah. That doesn't seem like a good deal. Oh, berries. Where are you now? Have you made it back 